Well, if you have any shopping left to do after Black Friday, Small Business Saturday is a good way to spend money in a way that benefits your community in more than one way. Tanya Trice, Executive Director of South Shore Chamber of Commerce, is here to tell us all about it. You've got a big weekend plan. Yeah, First yeah, of all, we welcome do. to the show. Thank Glad you. To have you here. Thank you for having me. So tell us what we can expect. Well, um, the weekend following um, Thanksgiving is going to be fantastic in the South Shore community. We are very excited. We have partnered with Eric Williams of the Silver Room in Hyde Park and Rob McKay of Connect Gallery in Hyde Park. And we're putting together an arts festival in South Shore where we will be showcasing local artists, um, musicians, uh, vendors from all around the city where they will have an opportunity to showcase their products and uh, we are looking to boost the economy for the local businesses in the community by attracting everyone to South Shore for this wonderful weekend. And just give us a rundown. What kind of uh, shopping can we do in South Shore? Well, you know what? We have everything, believe it or not. South Shore has wonderful uh, clothing boutiques. We have a fantastic bike clinic. We have some new restaurants that have just opened in the South Shore community. Uh, Chef Majani has opened a vegan restaurant that's fantastic. Huh. And uh, just things for children. And we're very excited to be showcasing our community at this time of year. Talk, uh, Tanya, a little bit about why it's so important to spend dollars in South because when you spend money in your community, that money circulates back through the community. And um, a lot of the business owners live right there in the community, and they also provide jobs in the community. That means that their employees will also spend money and is circulated back through the community. So uh, it's very important that we support those local businesses and keep them there in South Shore. And that's the mission of the South Shore Chamber, to help sustain and grow the local businesses that are in the community. You know, the South Side uh, gets such bad press. Um, mm -hmm. I I'm wondering um, if, if part of your mission is to help with that and encourage people, look, it's, first of all, it's, it's beautiful yes. in most of our neighborhoods on the South Side, on the south side of Chicago. Yeah. And there are businesses and you can find unique things. Absolutely. Uh, we have a beautiful community. We're 15 minutes from downtown, right on the lakefront, condos with unobstructed views of the lake. And... Um, you know, it is important that we uh, showcase our community to the rest of the city, and that's why we're excited about this uh, event that's taking place this weekend, Connect South Shore, and uh, a lot of people may be familiar with Connect through the Hyde Park event. Uh, they attract 15 to 20,000 people annually, and we're hoping that as the years go on, we can grow this event to the same number of uh, attendees in South Shore. We have a lot to offer, and we want the people throughout the city to come and take a look at South Shore. And so the idea is to bring everybody in, even from the suburbs, from around the city. Uh, best case scenario, how many people would you like to have? Oh, wow. Well, we would like to have um, at least 10,000, you know, and I, I know that's uh, wishful thinking, but, you know, the more the merrier. Come on out, find an opportunity for yourself in South Shore, take a look at some of the local businesses there in South Shore, and just see what the community is all about. Right now, we are working diligently to anchor their community and also to possibly attract back the 10,000 residents that have lost over the past decade. We want them to come back and take a look at South Shore and realize that there are still wonderful opportunities there. It's a wonderful place to raise your family. And uh, we have plenty of businesses and uh, retail and hoping to develop our nightlife even. We know the Silver Room is now open. Uh, how has that helped to attract people to the South Side? Well, you know what? He has an 18-year reputation. Most people know that he started in Wicker Park. He's moved down to Hyde Park. And we are very excited to have him in South Shore. Uh, he has a massive database. And um, his name is synonymous with community engagement, uh, people placing, growth, um, walkability. And we're excited to have him in the South Shore community working on this project with us. Well, what a terrific event. I know there's a website where we can get yes. some more information. Yes, um, you can check www.ssa42.org. Again, that's www.ssa42.org. And that has all the information about uh, this weekend's event, Connect South Shore. 
Well, it's going to be something uh, yes. to see. And uh, are there some artists that we might know who? Uh... Oh wow! Well, uh, <laughs> yes, there there are, but I cannot call the names. That's Eric William and Rob McKay's department. They are curating the spaces and. Uh, well, why gather... don't we just go down and find out? How about Come that? Come on down and find out. <laughs> Absolutely. It'll be whoever's performing. It's going to be great. <laughs> yes, yes. Live performances. Also, um, we expect to have a wonderful time. So we're looking for everyone to come out and enjoy themselves in South Shore this weekend. That'll be some great shopping. Yes, yes, yes. Tanya Trish, thank you so much. And thank to find you. out more on today's big event and find all the locations where you can participate, visit ssa42.org. Thank you again, Tanya. Thank you. After the break, we'll meet one of the small business owners featured in South Shore in that big event today. Stay with us.